All right, day 99. 99 consecutive days of walking at least one mile. Let me put the camera on, we'll get going. The ranger's eating already, I already fed him. You hungry, buddy? <laughs> Paid no attention. All right, 99 days in a row. Get this camera on, we'll get out of here. I'm gonna do three walks today. The first mile. Kind of cool today. Ugh. Go see what we can, trouble we can get in today. Always something interesting. All right. All right, buddy, you stay here. I'll be back. Stick around till the end of video three. See what Ranger's up to today. When we get back, I'm sure he'll be sleeping. All right, let me start this timer. All right. Today, I'm going to go down the, the main street and then cut over and walk uh, north-south and instead of east-west. Yesterday I was walking uh, closer to the beach and there were a bunch of hills again. Then I got kind of turned around. Couldn't, <laughs> couldn't find the car. Alright, put in your guesses how far I'll go, how long it'll take. Do one video and do three walks today on this one. So it'll be a little bit longer. Let's see what we can find. Yesterday I got kind of turned around. And I go park. I gotta remember. I just start parking on the main street so I can find the car. I park on these little side streets. I can't go get twisty and turny and not sure which way I went trouble finding the car gonna start parking on the main street and I always know where the main street is so if I get turned around and it'd be no problem to get back to the main street I'm gonna go down the uh, main street today and I'm sure I see a bunch of muscle cars there goes one Mustang we'll see how many we see today Better put the over under it. Uh, we'll say six, six, seven and a half. Do so you think I'll see under seven and a, under seven and a half or over seven and a half? Not counting Teslas. Probably see forty. Not counting. Not going to see too many dogs on this first trip. I don't think. First walk. Second walk, I might see more. So this will be walk number one of the day. we do at least three miles today. A mile and a half out, a mile and a half back. But I'm going to cut it up into three different videos. So a mile, a mile, a mile. See what we see today. So last time, last uh, Monday I did three. I saw the... See, I saw a black lab, saw, uh, man, I can't remember. It's a week ago. This week I went to the, was it Friday? I went to the uh, exotic uh, car shop and saw all those Ferraris and Lamborghinis, nine Ferraris, three Lamborghinis, one Maserati, one Triumph car. I knew they made motorcycles. They had a Triumph car, and then yesterday I saw a Triumph car. Only the back of it was in a garage, but you want to see that was yesterday. It was a green car. Very green. Green Prius. At the, at the uh, Fast Cars Limited, the exotic car shop, there was a green um, Lamborghini Mur Muria something i don't know how to pronounce it m-u-i-r-a i think it was worth two or three million dollars 69 lamborghini right next to it was a lamborghini countach 
Right next to that was a Lamborghini Diablo. So that was uh, three or four days ago. So if you want to see that, check it out. I gotta keep walking. I'm gonna cut across down here about a half a mile anyway, so. See what's going on today. Pulled out in front of that truck. They're cut across right now. All right, get down here to McKay and cut over. Getting ready to walk by the car shop with the usually out of the American vintage cars but they're closed on Mondays you'll see what they got they came by here uh, I think earlier or last week in the first part of the week oh he's got that 69 Lincoln sitting out here they've been trying to sell that for I don't know how long, two months, three months. I think I put the phone number in the last video if you want to, interested in it, 69 Lincoln. I don't know how much they want for it, but you can call the number on the video. I don't know what day that was. Sometime this week, past week. Hello. There's a Mustang and an old Chevy truck. Number two muscle car. Oh, there's a Corvette. Number three muscle car. An 80s Corvette. It's not in too good a shape. I'm not going in. Whoa! right through the red light slow down man they were coming right up on that traffic sped up to get through the light then they went right up on that aqua car the dodge uh challenger charger four-door charger number three muscle car maybe we'll hit the over today and like i think i said it at seven and a half the dodge hemi 392 oh boy big engine of the trip I don't think we're gonna see that many on this trip three and a half maybe uh oh comes an ambulance oh boy see if cars pull over today or just get in their way the other day they were just not even pulling over see what's happening today oh man he's flying down here Ain't where he's going uh oh cut it off here We're going right through that red light. Whoa. You never know what's going to happen. Always something. There's a little dog. Oh, he's crossing the street. It's a big dog. Medium dog. There he goes. Well, up on your right, we're coming up upon the world-famous 
tattoo parlor where people get their heads tattooed. We go by here every now and then. Go see if anybody's getting their head tattooed today. Kind of early in the day. They don't even open till 11, so they've just been opened a little while. It's a guitar repair shop. Uh, they got a couple little dogs in there. Is that three dogs now? Guess the dogs like to watch the people get the tattoos or something. I don't know. There's another guitar shop. That one just opened, as I recall, not too long ago. And then there's another guitar shop down here. Look at that big uh, Cadillac that they jacked up. I think I posted about that a month ago or so. That's a 50, uh, 40. I don't remember what year Cadillac that was. That girl must work at the tattoo place. She had a bunch of tattoos on her face. Yeah. I don't think I could do that. This place is closed on Mondays and Tuesdays. Already at a half a mile. Here comes McKay. I'm gonna cut across there. See what's going on up the, that way. There's a muscle car. What is that? Um, it's another Dodge, I think. Bright red. That must be a Challenger. Two doors. I think so. It's a Dodge Challenger. Let's check it out. Yep. Dodge Challenger. Charger has four doors. All right. Walk down here for a bit. I never walked a whole length on this uh, McKay before. We'll see. See what's going on down here. Is that four muscle cars, I think, now? Yeah, I think so. No, I've walked part of the street before, but never as far as I'm going to walk today. I'm going to go see what's going on. Got like a big white dog down here. I don't know if we'll get there. Time to see it. That's nice. They got purple. The purple, uh, like lilac or something. It's nice. Pretty. Oh, blooming this time of year. Sort of look like mini hibiscus. You don't see purple that often. Very rarely. They look like they're smaller too. I think they're hibiscus. Look, they got them all the way down their whole gate. Wow, that's pretty. All the way down here too. They're not blooming as much down there. They get more sun over here. Oh yeah, look at them. They get a lot more sun. All right, that was kind of cool. Thought it was going to be kind of cool. I wore this heavier coat. Now I got a feeling I could get hot. All right, 
I had never walked down here before. On this street, I don't believe. I mean, not this far down. I know I've walked past this school, but I was going east-west. Now I'm going north-south. That dog was gone. schools the other day. It's an elementary school here. Madison Elementary. Full day. Oh boy. I'm actually going to go a full day. They got to put it on the sign. Well, they usually only go a half a day or something. today. It's in April. I guess maybe they're getting ready for the next year or something. Oh, this is kind of neat. Look at this house. Got a bunch of bougainvillea Going up and down the Oh what is that? Is that a like a dinosaur? <laughs> Kinda of looks like they got it cut into the shape of a dinosaur, but I guess it's not. That's pretty neat. That does look like a tail here. And then that kind of looks like the head. Like a dinosaur, something, some kind of animal. Not really sure, but it definitely looked like a tail of a dinosaur from here. It's neat. Not sure. An old car there, but I don't know what it is. It's all covered up. A lot of cars are covered up. Don't know what they are. A couple more little dogs. I think we're at the over on dogs. I think that's four or five, five dogs or something. Wow, they got a nice yard. You just don't see yards this big in the South Bay that oh in a garage and a yard they must have been here from a long time 60s at least look at that they got a backyard the property's worth millions you got a wheelbarrow in the front All right, getting close to the first mile being done, if you can believe it. What do they got? They got like a elephant in their front yard. Ceramic elephant. Wow, they got a... They used to be a road. Look, they got the street sign up there. Must be looked like a 20 years, 30 years, or 40 years old. 30 anyway. Must have been a street here at one point. I don't know. I don't think so. Here's that roof. What is this? A mauve colored house with a green door. Check that out. The 
interesting color combination. Mauve and here's an orange door. Look at this one first. This one's an orange and gray. And this is mauve and magenta, uh, green. And a Dodge of some sort. And a green door. I don't know what kind of Dodge that is. I, may, I don't know if that's a Charger. Maybe. It's a Hemi. I don't know what kind of... Yeah, it is a Charger. It's like an older model. Yeah, I don't know. That's like seven or eight muscle cars. It's a cop car. This is like another cop car. Another I used to drive those Crown Victorias. I think this is one too. Somebody's buying the cop cars. There's two. Two right in a row almost. I used to have those I think in the 80s. Used to, cops used to drive them. All right. Not windy today and definitely not sunny. And it was a little colder when I started, but now it seems to have warmed up. Pretty pleasant. Yeah, and two shirts and a and a fleece jacket, but May have to take the jacket off sooner than later. What do you got going over here? I don't know, they're building something or tearing down something or just uh like they're doing much of nothing. This looks overgrown. See a little much more over here. It's like a mess. An interesting color scheme. Got a floating balloon and a birdhouse and all kinds of stuff. Here's the first mail truck of the day. Number one. There's that truck I went by the other day. I don't know what it is. We'll go take a quick look at it again. I don't know if it's a, a Dodge or a Ford or a Chevrolet or a GMC or... I don't know what it is. Because they took all the... Insignia is off, but it sure is in good shape and it's definitely from the 50s. It's re repainted. I'm not sure what it is. Look, don't touch. I don't know why they put all the work into it and now they put it on the street. I don't know, 50, 50 something. It says for sale. I don't know. Looks really good, but it's sitting on the street. I don't know what year it is, 50 something. Let me know if you know what year and what make. I can't look that car up, truck up, because uh, I don't even know, I have to do a picture of it, try to find a Google image, I guess. A cute kind of a cute little house 
It's Midwestern, very Midwestern. Kind of like vinyl siding on it. Looks like it, but it's not. It must be wood. Looks like it's right out of the 50s. Well, there goes a second one, the number two, UPS. Look at this car, this is like a shell of a car. No wheels, no, it doesn't look like it has any interior. I don't know what it is, just a shell of some type of car. I don't know what it is. The 50s maybe? Oh, it's the 50s or the 40s? Type of shell of a car, though. It's like a van of some sort. In the 40s, I think. No, I don't know. 50s, I guess. It actually, has an air conditioning and stuff. I'd say it's from the 50s. All right, I'm gonna walk up here a little bit, and then I'm gonna start the in the first walk. Yeah, that was kind of interesting stuff. A car from the 50s, a shell of a, another car, I guess, from the 50s. Not really sure. Let me know if you know. Go down here, look at this VW bus. We'll turn around. These people with the dogs walk by a little bit, so I go look at this bus. And I'll turn around. Oh, the sky blue. Oh, she's stopping again. Probably right, has 1960 something. I don't know what year. Let me know if you know the year. I don't know. See what the tail lights look like. Okay, so it's probably mid 60s. Bigger tail lights, the smaller tail lights would be the early 60s. Oh, we got a flat tire, two of them. Maybe they don't do street cleaning. Yeah, they do. They have them, I don't know how they move it. All right, if you guessed 1.21 in 26 minutes and 50 seconds, you are the winner. And that's the first walk. Uh, now I do the second walk of the day. You take the jacket off. Stop the camera. We'll put a do getting ready to do walk number two. I'll put a uh, a link to a video you might like. Subscribe. Let me turn this off. Start again.